And we're back again. I've got a couple random thoughts on what we can do. Pretty literally random, really, but... Use the ball on the shelf. Ball two. Chuck the ball at the cap. Well, I'm out of ideas. I'm not really understanding why he does that exactly. I mean, the cat was an ugly brute who looked like he owned the joint. Or if we can get 50 Hi, bucks from, this, from Hello here. again, sir. And how may I help you this time? No, oh, we haven't asked him about all these people, have we? What do you know about that couple? Oh. They're American. Is that all? The chap's a little odd. As for the lady, it's a funny thing. But I get the impression she's a lot cleverer than she's letting on. Maybe she's a spy. I met an interesting guy earlier, a cab driver. Ah, that would have to be Uta, a barbaric sort of chap. Oh, he's not that bad. You know how he speaks in Pidgin English? That's how he speaks in Arabic, too. <laughs> Who's the guy selling the kebabs? Oh, that's Arto. A miserable blighter, to be sure, sir. He doesn't seem very happy. He never is. Day in, day out, a face like a wet Wednesday. Whatever one of those is. Does he speak any English? Not cogently, no. Just a moment. Cogently. Easy to understand or clear. There, right. Seriously, do you really think this thing's so great? Take it away, you tempter. So long, Nijo. Toodle pip, sir. Toodle pip. Hello again, Pearl. Why, hello, George. It's such a pleasure to see you again. Have you ever heard of a hill called the Bull's Head? No. No, I haven't. Is it nearby? I'm not sure. Sounds awful romantic. The Bull's Head Hill. Have you met the taxi man, Ultar? Heavens, yes. Yeah. What a big man. Very muscular. But you didn't go for a ride. Why, George, you're <laughs> absolutely the most... Oh. You mean a taxi ride? No, Dwayne wasn't interested, so it didn't happen. I've got to go now, Pearl. That's been a... Let's see what we can get going around here. This is probably just exit back to the world map, but... If it's not... I figured going out into the country... Yeah. The stand had kebabs dangling from the canopy. As a marketing device, it lacked something. Suddenly, I realized the horrific truth. The guy was basting the kebabs with a toilet brush. <laughs> what do you make of this, sir? You buy kebab. You buy kebab. Yum. Most good. Yeah. I'd value your opinion on this, sir. Nah. You buy kebab. None? I'm going to hit you with this tire iron. Does this mean anything or to you? No. Turkey. No, you buy kebab. Yeah, I'm just well, sensing a running theme. Most. Hi there, Dwayne. Hi there, Ju. Have you had any dealings with the kebab seller? Absolutely not. Pearl's already had one attack of Montezuma's revenge. <laughs> Have you ever heard of a hill called the Bull's Head? Can't say as I have. Where's that? I don't know. I'm trying to find out. Bull's Head, huh? I must remember that. Sounds scenic. <laughs> have you met Ultar? Almost luxurious air-conditioned taxi ride, mister. Yeah, the cabbie. Tried to pull a bunco on us. Take us on a wild goose chase off into nowhere. What do you think of this? It's a ball. Big deal. Shake hands, Dwayne. 
Why? I'm just being friendly. Let's just be friendly by keeping our hands to ourselves. Yeah? No one falls for okay, it. Okay, well, I... Count on it. We are running out of things to do. I'm going to annoy the cats more. If I ring it while <laughs> ah, as I didn't see the point of going all the way over. I hadn't come all this way. There was some great bargain. <laughs> I want to tease the cat. Clearly there's a reason we can make it go up there. I need your Hello That's not a very friendly cat. Yeah, same no. thing. Why do you keep it? Oh as keep fiercely and, and it's Look, this is going to sound a ah. bit strange, but I need Arto's brush. What? The brush he bastes the kebabs with? Yes. Let me find some dirty postcards for you instead. Nijo, this is serious. Ardo stole that brush he's using from a friend, and I want to get it back. Perhaps I could help you, old chap. Ah, I remember that Maybe. now. Maybe. Right. Perhaps. Maybe what? Perhaps what? I do not wish to see mercenaries, sir, but uh, I am a merchant. And merchants trade. Merchant? This isn't Sears and Roebuck here. Well, if you're going to be disagreeable... No, no, you're right. Uh, what would you like? I seem to recall that you have something that might alleviate my boredom. A globe of delight. A Rubicon steroid of heavenly pleasure. You mean the ball, don't you? A tiny sperula form that barely spans my hand, yet promises hours of amusement. If you mean the ball, why don't you just say so? Can I have the ball back, mister? <laughs> All right, here you go. Thank you, sir. People say bad things about Americans, but you're okay in my book. What people? What bad things? Never mind that now. Remember the brush? Right, yes, the brush. All you have to do with Arto is be polite. It lightens his day, makes it all worthwhile for him again. How can I be polite to the guy when I can't speak a word of Syrian? Arabic. That's what I meant. Simply memorize this phrase. Il ach il kalb. Il ach il kalb. Close enough. Now, il go over to Arto means. and deliver those honeyed words even unto his delicate ear. He won't be able to do enough for you. Really? Really. So, what horrible so thing are we getting Kudu. set up for? Now, we will be able to use the bathroom. Hello again, sir. Hello. Kebab? Mmm. Yeah. Um. Il Akul Kalb? Filthy. Bad. Bad. I kill you. Whoa. Calm down. I just. Feet. Do your thing. Did we mispronounce it? Or did he set us up? It must have taken... Hello again. Okay. 
What the heck did you tell me to tell him? Patience, sir. Patience? Patience? I've been chased by a homicidal kebab seller, and you expect me to be patient? But consider, sir, while you were running from the irate Arto, the irate Arto wasn't using the brush. Hold on. Are you telling me that I've been used as a diversionary tactic? Your brush, sir. <laughs> I can't believe that you put me on that kebab seller's death list for a toilet brush. The ends justify the means, sir. Yeah, but I noticed it wasn't your butt that was on the line, though. They also serve who only stand and wait, sir. Oh, spare me. Thanks for getting the brush and risking my life to do it. Anytime. Glad to be of service. So long, Nijo. Toodle peep, sir. I don't want to know what he said now. I don't feel like whacking the cat with the... Eh. Well, I suppose we're just going to have to do what we obviously want to use it for. Here's your brush, sir. It wasn't easy getting it back. The manager took the brush from me, gave me the toilet keys as my reward, and stomped off. What was all that about? Manager, he say, Bah, look at state of this. Need much cleaning in detergent before go around my U-Bend. He said all that? Body language account for much, you know. Oh, yes, indeedy. I am now the Lord of the Bathroom. I knew the door was locked. None may use the facilities without my say-so. Well, I haven't seen one of those in years. Oops. Oh, come on. You just, like, grabbed that knowing it would come. It was the short length of chain I'd taken from the toilet at the Club Alamut. I hadn't drunk anything since the morning, and I didn't need to use it. The mirror was as clean as anything else in there. there anything else to see here? And I thought the French had strange toilets. It was a roller towel dispenser. Doesn't look like it. I'm gonna make you the key master for now. Hello again, Ultar. Praise be to Allah. Look, I've got the keys to the toilet. Is this like gold thing I read in GQ? <laughs> what does il akal kalb mean? Who teach you that? Nejo told me to say it to Arto. And Arto come after you with big knife, yes? Yeah, how did you know? I know Arto. You tell him in bad Arabic that his kebabs made from dog meat. I said he was using dog food? No wonder he went crazy. No. Ultar not mean meat for dog. Ultar mean meat of dog. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> well, I still don't have any... Oh! The delights of the... Yes, yes, yes. What does this toilet chain mean to you? You got brush back so you could steal chain? You sure strange cookie, mister, yes? Yeah, I'm sure it'll work out. See you around, Ultar. May good fortune... Hello, sir. Lovely carpet. Um, il akul kalb? <laughs> you speak Nejo, yes? <laughs> uh, that... What do you think of this? Lovely carpet, yes! 
Lovely, lovely carpets. Does this mean anything to you? Yes, yes, carpets, yes? Uh, yes. Ma'a salama. Lovely carpets, yes. He's still pissed at us. Hello again, sir. Filthy! Okay, okay. Yep. Can we do anything with this chain hmm. link? Hmm. 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 Yeah. Chain the cat. Eh, we can't chain the cat up. Oh, he's having a grand old time with that, isn't he? I hadn't come all. Ha! Yeah, this ought to be good. That wasn't quite the reaction I was expecting. The statuette looked pretty sorry for itself after its fall, chipped with both arms broken off. Hmm. Wonder if we can convince him we got this at Bull's Head. Hi there, Dwight. Hi there, Joe. What do you think of this? Hmm. Looks like the kind of thing Pearl might be interested in. Not old enough, though. What does this to- It means that somewhere, somebody can't flush the toilet. Yeah, we're jerks. I've got the keys to a toilet here. Executive washroom? Not exactly. Okay, we Count on. Hello again, Pearl. Why, hello. Yep, yep, yep. Have you had anything from the kebab stand? Hey, heavens no, with my digestion. <laughs> Do you know what il akal kalb means? My, sounds romantic. Yeah, I don't think it is, though. Are you interested in antiquities? Am I? What have you got there, George? How about this fine statuette? Oh, George, that would be ideal, except, I don't know, it looks new, George. You would be trying to make a fool out of me, would you, George? Good God, no, Pearl. Nothing could be further from my mind. What do you think of this toy? My, but you're a strange one, George. I've got to go now. The pain of play. We've actually got some ideas. That involved messing around in the bathroom. What was that again? In the still air, the smell hot. You know, it'll fast travel me anywhere except here. It's kind of weird. I guess because it has to do the animation and all that. Okay, so it won't fast me here either. I knew that... Because we have to open it at the time. Maybe not. Hmm. 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 Why 
Why must none of my ideas pan out? I don't know, maybe he's stupid. Hello again, Ultar. Praise be to Allah. Probably not, but... Look at this. Ha! Statuette is broken. Not worth much. Uh, no, he's not stupid. What do you think of this plot? Not much there. Not enough to make tasteful garden gnome, for example. How about a really small garden gnome? Ultar not think so. Yeah. See you around. May good. Hello, sir. Does this mean... Yes, yes. You know, we may as well exhaust all options. Does this mean... Yes, yes. What do you think? Hello, sir. Does this mean anything? Yes, yes. What do you think? Hello, sir. What do you love? Ooh, we got a new Ma response out of him. Lovely carpets, yes. The stand was selling. This is what travel is all about. Roam the world and discover strange fruit. Ah, yes. Truly the world, the mark of a world traveler. The stand was hawking ancient machine parts that seemed to be from a stripped down printing press. I couldn't imagine where they'd come from or who'd want them. Did he take the ball away? Hi, Nijo. Hello again, sir. And how may I help you this time? May I have this statuette? It is broken, after all. Certainly. And when my father deals with that feline for breaking it, you can have a Davy Crockett hat as well. Oh, sweet. What does this toilet chain mean to you? Are you building a bathroom in easy installments? Maybe. Do you recognize these keys? No. This plaster was very useful in Ireland. Really? Your fund of travelers' tales never ceases to enthrall me. Do you know the name Merlin? I'm afraid not, old bean. Here, shake hands, Nijo. I'd rather not, sir. Hey, we don't, he don't know where we've been. What do you make of this? Hmm. A man-sized double ply tissue stained with Bestheimer's number 12 white pancake grease paint, apparently. Wow. Look at this. A lifting key as used by Parisian sewer workers. Kalu Kalei, sir. I must remember this day for posterity. My grandchildren will be fascinated. I'm not really sure if he's serious or not. Have you seen this man before? No, sir. I'm glad to say. Cold eyes. So long, Nijo. Toodle pe I hadn't come all this... As I didn't see the point... Invisible cat. He didn't have anything that I needed. at a bit of a loss again it seems the grease paint oh. had worked magic now it looked like aged marble instead of cheap plaster I thought I did that I, seriously I thought I hello again, tried Pearl. that one why hello what do you think of this fine piece of ancient statuary oh not that just what I've been looking for. Just one thing, though. Oh? Hey, it looks awful similar to that modern one you showed me. Ah, well, that's because... You see, that's because... That's because... That's because the first one I showed you was a modern copy of this one. And 
And I sought out the artist who'd done the copy and bought the original. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Oh, George, how can you ever forgive me? There's nothing to forgive, believe me. Would you like it? Would I ever? I'm not carrying the money, though. If you go and find Dwayne, he'll pay you for it. If he gives you any trouble, just tell him that I want it. I've got to go now, Pearl. I feel terrible. We're defrauding this woman. Hi there, Dwayne. Hi there, George. What do you think of this? Good gravy. Looks old. Yeah. I had to turn this town upside down. Boy, your luck's better than ours. Looks Roman. I wouldn't know. What'll they say back home? How much do you want, George? Oh, I couldn't. It's the find of a lifetime. I mean... Fifty bucks. Fifty bucks. Take it or leave it. I'll take it. Here you go. And here I and was here expecting him go. to say fifty bucks. Thanks for the money, Dwayne. This will... I ought to be thanking you for finding this Roman statuette. Okay. Count up. There he is. That seems a pretty good stopping point. We'll get to Bull's Head and call it a video. Hello again, Ultar. Praise be. About Bull's Head Hill. Are you desirous of seeing this most splendid place? Well, maybe. A terrific bargain. Only 50 of your Yankee bucks. 50, huh? Okay, it's a deal. Here's the cash. Ah, most splendid. As you say, the cash price moolah is correct. Mister, we make with haste. Where exactly is your taxi? Because the only vehicle I can see around here is an aging army surplus truck. Yes? Ah. Okay, <laughs> I'll be along in a minute. It didn't seem right to take off with the toilet keys, so I left them on the bar. Aw, oh, and here I was going to be Lord of the Commode. Making off with their ability to flush, George. I mean, hello again, Ultar. His most splendid and adventurous client. That's your taxi? Oh yes, most assuredly, most entirely splendid taxi in all Marib. It looks like an old army truck to me. Bah! You Americans with your checky board caps and your jet horses, you have lost sight of what a taxi should truly be. About four tons, by the look of it. There, you have hit the nail in the nutshell. Okay, already, let's go. Regrettably not, most esteemed pair. There is a minor problem of a tiny nature. The fan belt has taken it upon itself to break. So, what are you going to do? What can I do? I must wait for a ride to the garage for a replacement. How long is that going to take? One day, maybe six. I can't wait that long. We've got to get moving. But how, my friend? I'll think of something. Oh, it's obvious. We replaced the fan belt with the... Uh, yeah. Bye for now, Ultar. May good... Hello again. He's mo... What is this toy... You got brush... No, oh, wait, that's not Bye it. Bye for now, Ult May good... Okay, next time we will try and figure out exactly how to get his truck working. Maybe we can use kebabs. Later, everyone.